a former U.S. Marine suspected of killing his girlfriend in 2016 has been added to the 15 most wanted list for the U.S. S. Marshals, believed to be hiding out in Central America, or in Mexico. The agency is now offering up to $50,000 for any information leading to the arrest of Raymond R. J. McLeod Jr. Comma 37, who was initially wanted by the San Diego Police Department for the murder of 30 year old Crystal Mitchell. Raymond McLeod will be the first fugitive in history on our 15 most wanted list with an initial reward of up to $50,000, U.S. S. Marshal Service Director Donald Washington said in a Monday release. We want McLeod's new status as a 15 most wanted fugitive, and the $50,000 reward amount to be broadcasted far and wide. McLeod poses a significant threat to the public, and must be brought to justice. McLeod has been described as 511 and 245 pounds. He is also known to go by R.J. Matt, or Mateo. On June 10, 2016, San Diego police found Mitchell not breathing at an apartment on the 7600 block of Mission George Road in San Diego, California. She was pronounced dead at the scene by medics. At the scene, detectives found signs of a struggle and determined that Mitchell was last seen with McLeod. The pair had been in San Diego visiting friends at the time. McLeod was charged with murder by the San Diego District Attorney's Office and in December. In 2016, the U.S. Marshals were tapped to join in on the manhunt for him. McLear disappeared without a trace after taking Mitchell's car to the airport, where he rented a new car, and drove straight to Mexico. The father has an extensive history of violence against women, with many past girlfriends describing him as very dangerous. McLeod had been charged twice with domestic violence, one of which occurred just three months before Mitchell was murdered. The Marine pleaded not guilty to assaulting his second wife in Riverside, California, and was released on $50,000 bond. McLeod's last reported location was in Guatemala March 2017, but he has also been spotted in Honduras along with Billy's and Mexico. The U.S. Embassy in Billy's issued a bulletin to police and media to look out for McLeod in 2016. The passage of time will never deter the marshal's fugitive investigation for McLeod, said U. S. Marshal Steve Stafford of the Southern District of California. If anything, it fuels our determination. We will leave no stone unturned until he is brought to justice.